Amart All Sports in the JPO Maker Village, proudly supporting the boot. With Southern Cross Television, we've got the territory covered. And Harvey Norman Darwin. Welcome to the boot. Round two of the TIO NTFL Premier League season had its share of upsets. Tigers mauled the Saints on Saturday afternoon. Nycliffe trailed by 13 points at the first change. This goal levelled the scores. Six goals to Saints three in the second quarter and Nycliffe ran off with the game. Ashley Duncan and Julian Lockwood kicked four each for the Tigers. A great start to the Tigers season. The Saints have work to do. Out at Norville Oval, a seven goal third quarter blasted the Crocs to a win against the Magpies. Back at Gardens Oval on Sunday afternoon, the Tiwi Bombers struggled at first against the bigger bodies of Waratahs. Waylon Manson kicked two from four in the first quarter for the Warriors. The Tiwi regrouped and began winning the centre clearances to grab three quick goals. But the Tiwi attack stalled in the second, and undisciplined play cost them at least two goals. Waratahs leading by 26 points at the final break. The sky darkened, thunder rumbled, and the Tiwi upped the pressure. 40 metres out, he stabs at it and I said, tell you what, that's an experienced kick. Two goals from Jared Cunningham in the final minutes left the Tiwi eight points short at the siren. Bill, it's been the perfect start to the season for the Waratahs Football Club. Well, I don't know about perfect, Jared. You know, we were lucky to get over the line yesterday, but uh, look, the big surprise was young Waylon Manson, a kid from um, Kununurra. Kicked eight, eight five, in fact. You're up against the uh, reigning premiers this weekend in Wanderers Football Club. Any changes uh, for the game? Uh, there's a fella. Uh, from Melbourne that might be coming in um, for Bowler. Um, you know, there's been a lot of talk and speculation and uh, he's pretty keen to come up, so it'll be good for Darwin Footy if he, if he turns up and has a run this weekend. Darwin made the best of the rain at Gardens Oval to lead Wanderers by a goal at the first break in their Round 2 Premier League game. The bus led all the way until a goal in the final minute lifted the Eagles to a two-point win. Round 2 Division 1 games began with Tracy Village and Nycliffe at Gardens Oval on Saturday afternoon. After a slow start by both teams, the Tigers led at every change. Bradley Paris and Theo Rossides kicked three goals each for Nycliffe, and Wanderers made short work of Darwin on Sunday afternoon. The Buffs scored four of their five majors in the final quarter. By then, the Eagles had logged 25 goals in a massive 129-point winning margin. In other Division I results, Southern Districts beat the Magpies, Banks prevailed over Waratahs, and the Wet Air Magic continued with a 36-point win over Pints. There were more big wins in Division II. Olympic, Banks, Jabiru and University all successful. Banks lead the competition on percentage. 